guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Lady Survival and recently my husband and I moved to a new house and um, we're still living with his mom for now and eventually we will be moving out on our own when I finish all of my immigration stuff. I have my green card interview coming up uh, in April and that means that I'll be able to work soon and that's like the main thing that we've needed in order for us to be able to move out on our own so that we're both making some money. But for now this is the place that we are staying in. It is a townhouse and this is our gaming room. So I think we did a really good job at making it look super cool. Um, it's a lot bigger than our room at our other house and I was showing it on my Instagram and a lot of you guys wanted me to do a tour of it. So I'm going to be doing that for you today. And of course I had to get into a really cute outfit to do this for you guys today because um, I don't usually dress like this when I'm hanging out in gaming but there are days where I do enjoy really going for it you know and just feeling like a hot gamer while I'm playing WoW. Um, I feel like it ups my skill level a little bit so yeah we're just kind of going for the whole like gamer streamer aesthetic today um, that is what I would love to do one day and I have been working on getting my setup good to go I have a good headset a good mic good everything mouse keyboard I'm pretty much like fully set up to go I even have like an overlay and everything set up on OBS like I'm pretty much good to start streaming I'm just really really shy basically just living the lifestyle that I would be living if I were able to fully embrace it uh, so of course I could ramble on forever but we're gonna go ahead and actually jump on into the tour and I hope that you guys enjoy so we're just gonna start with kind of the boring part which is the door um, Derek has his bass guitar here we have our world of work craft calendar where we can just write down stuff that's happening like my birthday was on March 17th and yeah we got a poster up there a little minecraft sword the door we have a spot where we can hang like sweaters and stuff and our whiteboard that we still need to hang up and we also have a heater for if it's ever like cold in here um, then we have our closet um, we're not actually gonna go in there because it's boring and messy uh, my tripod where I was filming my little intro for you guys and then we get into the really exciting stuff. Oh my gosh. Um, there's a few random things here on the floor. Just kind of ignore them. We have to sell their like old computers. We have to sell them. And Derek has his little toolkit up here right now. But this is the really, really exciting part. So got some World of Warcraft posters up at the top. Um, these are posters out of my, let me show you just so you guys know, out of this poster book. I ordered it on Amazon. And it had like 32 removable posters in it. So a lot of the posters that you see around the room are out of that book, just so you guys know. So very, very cute. Um, up here, I have a few of my collector's editions. We have Burning Crusade, Wrath of the Lich King, Cataclysm, and Shadowlands. I thought that those ones looked the coolest, so I put those, one on, those ones on the top. And then in front of that, I have all of my little stuffed animals. Um, we have our fell kitty, we have my old iPhone custom Sylvanas case, uh, our little fairy dragon, um, a little purple zombie murloc, a frost wolf, um, shadow paw, I believe, I forget, um, a little Pepe, a Kyrian one, and a little wyvern with this little horrid thing, and we have another fell kitty. Basically, I already had a fell kitty, and then Derek bought me one when I came to visit, and he didn't know that I already had one, but I still love it. Um, and then moving on to the rest of my shelf, um, I have my little Horde Alliance coin thing, um, but I like it on the Horde side. This came with Battle for Azeroth Collector's Edition, and I also knocked over my Twin Blade of Azanoth keychain. Um, I got this Collector's Edition um, Dark Portal pin off of the Blizzard store before they did their rework. Here is a custom mug that I got from someone that I follow on Instagram. I don't know if I remember her thing, but if I find it, I will definitely put it in. And then I have my refreshing spring water uh, water bottle, um, a few little Sylvanas pins, and then a couple more collector's editions. I have my Warlords of Draenor and Battle for Azeroth here. And then we move over to here. I have a Horde wallet that I think I got off of Jinx. And then I have a few uh, World of Warcraft cups that I got years ago, I think on eBay. Um, we have one of my little Sylvanas uh, statue thingies. Um, I don't remember where this was from, but I'll put a thing up on the screen if I ever find it. Um, another little Sylvanas figure. Pretty much all of my action figures are off of eBay, so you can just find those on there. Um, I have a little... Sylvanas one here again, and that's just a thing out of a little calendar. 
And then moving on down, we have, I have so many of these boxes. Like for example, the vanilla one in behind there, I don't know if you can see, but there's like a stack of them. And I literally have like four vanilla boxes because I'm a crazy person and will just like buy them if I find them at the store. I'm like, ooh, another box. So I have like multiple copies of things, but this is just basically all of my boxes. Um, Sylvanas Pop Vinyl. Um, and then I have a little Murloc card that Derek got me for Valentine's Day. And in behind here, let me show you guys. This is just a mug thing that I got and I put a bunch of World of Warcraft stickers onto it. And this is from Carl's Jr. They had like a Shadowlands promo day so Derek and I went and got our little cups. So of course I had to keep it but they're not super cool so I just kind of tuck them back here. Um, and then moving on, I got this from Anime North um, in Ontario, Canada a few years ago. So it's not like Blizzard official, but it's very cool. Um, Warcraft 3 Reign of Chaos um, Collector's Edition that I bought off of a customer at Shoppers Drug Mart who had it and they like sold it to me and I was like, hell yeah, I'll buy it. Um, yeah. And then we have some Shadowlands pins. We have the Folk and Fairy Tales book, Grimoire of the Shadowlands. And then a bunch of trading card stuff. Derek got me most of this stuff, but most of these I got at like thrift stores and everything. Um, and then this is CDs that were out of the um, collector's editions as well. And then moving on over to here, um, I have a lot of my art books out of the collector's editions. Um, I just like to take that kind of stuff out so it looks like I have more stuff on display. Um, so yeah, I'll just all that kind of stuff. And then we have the Exploring Azeroth book. Um, for Eastern Kingdoms. We just have a couple more pop vinyls, Illidan, Arthas, a uh, little Murloc, and Thrall down here. And I have two ultimate visual guides because I'm a crazy person and I wanted two of them. And then I have all of my Chronicle volumes. Sitting down here, um, kind of just some random stuff, my poster book. And then I have a bunch of calendar pictures that I just didn't have a spot for, so I just kind of shoved them there. Um, and just a few like other things that just didn't really fit. Um, we have my King Lane down there, and then this is all of my World of Warcraft book collection stuff. Very, very cool. Um, we have a battle chest here as well, um, some guides, and also we have these official World of Warcraft magazines. So, yeah, very, very cool. So that is basically my entire shelf, and also I have my Sylvanas backpack that's just hanging out in the corner. It likes to fall over sometimes, though. But yeah, this is... My shelf, I've always wanted to do a video of my little shelf, so we're just throwing it into the room tour video because it is in the room. Um, okay, and then uh, moving on to Derek's bookshelf, we have um, another World of Warcraft picture, and this is one of Derek's artworks he has up on the wall. There's a few more of his arts over on his side of the room, so I'll show you guys that. He does really, really cool digital art stuff and everything. Um, this is my sword. It's Arwen's sword from Lord of the Rings. And Derek just has all of his books. Lots of cool stuff. Um, it's kind of organized. This is all like kind of dream and like brain cool stuff. Um, this is all like digital art and like 3D design stuff. And, um, and then there's also these rocks that are from my husband's um, claim that he has. And these are thunder eggs. And they're like his own rocks and everything. So I'll put a link to his website and like his Etsy where he sells his rocks and minerals and all that kind of stuff because it's just really cool. Um, this is a secret compartment with like notebooks and stuff that aren't super pretty. Um, and then this shelf is kind of just like, I don't really know, I guess just like fun books and stuff, nostalgia kind of stuff, I guess. Anything that didn't fit in those categories. And we got some binders down here and then again just kind of random stuff like books about cats and stuff. So yeah, that's our cool. This is just basically like our collections and I think it's a really good representation of us, which obviously my life is World of Warcraft and Derek's life is very like, I don't know, he has a lot of like book smarts and stuff and interests and hobbies and everything. So the books kind of represent that. Uh, moving on, we have our window, which we have put up a uh, blanket. Derek made this. It's like a glitched out um, horde blanket that he had custom printed for us. So it's really, really nice. We like to block out the sun and everything, but it's still trying to come through. Um, down here, I have my Helm of Domination that I got off the Blizzard store, and I just keep it on top of the box that it came in because it looks so cool. 
it's like the coolest thing ever, but you can't wear it, unfortunately. It's too small to wear. And then beside that, in the center, kind of, mostly, uh, is my Sylvanas Windrunner statue. She is the queen of my life. I freaking love her. Um, I'm so glad that she's like right here next to me where I game and she's on her beautiful box. Ugh, I love it. And then um, we're kind of moving over into the gaming spot, which is the coolest part. Um, I have a mirror right here so that right by my chair, I can like look at myself and take selfies and all that kind of stuff. Make sure my hair is good and everything. Um, yeah, so we are entering in to my half. Can you guys tell? that this is my half. Um, very sylvanas -y. Uh This is a wall scroll that I got off of Etsy a few years ago. It's kind of faded a bit from like sunlight that's hit it in my old room. It used to be in front of the window, so it's a little faded. Um, then I have this Sylvanas poster that I think I got on eBay, I believe. I don't really remember. And then I have a few calendar things just out. I just thought that they looked really, really cool going down there. And then a little map of Azeroth in behind. And then this is just my kind of little um, table thing. So I have this really cool plasma orb that my um, uncle Craig, uh, Derek's uncle, uh, he got for me for Christmas because we did like a secret Santa kind of thing and he got my name. And I was like, I just want anything purple. So he got me a plasma orb and it is so cool. Um, so yeah, that's awesome. And then I just have a Killstar cup here. Um, I have this little World of Warcraft cup that just has like a phone charger and like hair scrunchies and just random stuff. Um, and these little things, I just keep stuff. This is my um, camera battery charger thing and I just keep like headphones and just any little like things that I might need near here. Um, and then I have a couple notebooks as well. So those just hang out. And down here we have our modem or router or whatever. I don't know if it's the same thing. Um, I have a tripod down here, um, some crystals a ring light and also there's like a pop filter down here for a microphone but I'm not using it right now and this is my little plugs and everything so yeah that's my little corner but going into the exciting part oh my gosh okay so this is a custom Sylvanas towel that Derek made for me kind of like how he made the blanket um so she's kind of like glitched out and over here he has an Illidan one too which is really really cool um so yeah that's kind of like I love how they frame our computers. It's like they're both hanging down, kind of like war banners, kind of. Um, and then here is my first monitor. This is my big main one. It's 27 inches. And then this one's just a smaller um, thrift store one that we had. So I actually just recently finally got dual monitors set up because Derek bought his own 27 inch monitor before he had both of these tiny ones but then he got that new one so then I was able to take one of the tiny ones so that is awesome here let me um move my chair out of the way here um so yeah this is my little spot it's so cool I love coming over here um I got this microphone just like a couple weeks ago this is the Hyper X Quad I believe it's called and it's purple you can change it to any color, but of course I changed it to purple. Um, I got it on my little boom stand thing, whatever they're called. And then here I have my Razer Kitty headset, um, which I have set to green and purple because they're my favorite colors. And I also have this custom um, engraved LED sign thing that I got on Etsy and it says Lady Survival, which is my name. Um, so I thought that was really special and it can change colors when you like tap it and stuff. It's really cool, but obviously I like it on purple and I just went past it, so we're just going to leave it. Oh, this one changes, so that's really cool too. Um, this is my tea from this morning. Um, super good stuff. It says Crazy Cat Lady, of course. Um, up here I have um, some crystals, little jade kitties and just some crystals. Um, birth control because I don't want kids and I'm always here, so this is where I keep it. And yeah, and then here we have my... Uh, Razer Black Widow Chroma V2 I think it is. It's been a long time um, and I have my lip balm as well because I'm always like chewing on my lips and like licking my lips when I'm gaming because I get like stressed kind of especially when I'm playing like Heroes of the Storm and I'm like kicking ass I'm like always biting my lips and stuff so I always need lip balm um, and then I have my Razer Trinity mouse which is so cool because it has all these buttons on it um, and then we have my cool Shadowlands mouse pad. I love it. I've been playing Burning Crusade Classic recently and I'm leveling my 
Hunter. She's level 62 right now. We're like halfway through Zangermarsh. I didn't really get into Burning Crusade when it first came out. I like went through the dark portal and Derek and I played for the first day and then we just like didn't like it. It was just weird and there was phasing and everyone was like boosting so we kind of took a break from it but now that it's completely dead and there's like nine people on my server literally like because it's all split up with like Burning Crusade Classic and regular Classic the Burning Crusade version is dead. There's literally like nine people on my server so kind of crazy but I'm still really enjoying the nostalgia of questing through all the Burning Crusade zones so yeah. Here is my second monitor and usually I have Killstar up and I just browse clothes and stuff while I'm gaming or watch YouTube but usually I'm shopping on my other monitor so yeah. It's pretty much my area. I think it's really really cool. Um, it's pretty much the best that my gaming area has ever looked. I think the only thing that could be cooler is if the walls were purple and if we had LED lights up, but we're not going to bother doing that because we won't be living here for that long. Um, and then there's my chair. I should probably show you guys that. Um, so yeah, this is just a chair that we got off of Amazon. Um, Derek's is the same as well. Derek is hanging out here while I film. Um, and then I put my Murloc onesie on top. Um, Dark Lady Cosplay does this too. I like saw it in one of her videos and I was like, that is the cutest thing ever. So I just kind of like tucked the bottom part in because it was like too long and like hanging on the ground and stuff. So yeah, but it's just so cute because now I have a little Murloc on top. So yeah, totally inspired by Dark Lady Cosplay. I love it so much. She is amazing. Oh yes, and then also I guess you guys probably want to see my actual PC a little bit better too. I will um, put all of the specs for it up on the screen. Um, Derek has the exact same computer as me. We literally just ordered the same one and he picked everything out because I have no idea. Um, but yeah, mine's set to purple and his is set to green. Um, it's really, really good. We've had them for like over a year and no problems so far. Now, kind of moving on to the center area here, um, we have this TV up on our wall, which is actually um, this PC right here. So we have three PCs all together, which is so cool. And also, our desks that we have have these like headset holder things and also they have um, cup holders too. So it's really, really cool. We um, got our desks from Big Lots when it was like Black Friday or something. There was like a really good deal, but we really, really like them. They have like the risers on them and stuff. Super good. We're really, really enjoying them. So this is our TV. We always watch like movies and YouTube and all kinds of stuff up here. 90% um, of the time you will catch us watching Troll 2 or The Room. They are the go-tos, so yeah. Um, above that, we have a map of Azeroth, of course. And then over here, we have Derek's Illidan towel, which looks so good. The Sylvanas and the Illidan, it's perfect. And also with our monitors, um, as you can see, we both have 27 inch ones, and then the ones in the middle are smaller. I think they're like 22 or 23, um, but it's actually perfect because it kind of like comes down and leaves like a perfect spot for our TV, so. We really like it, but one day we probably will up upgrade to like 27 inch and just move the TV up and all that stuff. So yeah, here is our PC that goes up to our TV. Um, this is also what we use if we're streaming. So Derek has it set up that um, he can be playing a game on his and I can be playing one on mine and we like stream them up to our streaming PC. So I don't even know how all that works, but he is the techie guy behind all of that magic, so very, very cool. Um, we do want to get into streaming again at some point. That would be really fun. Um, down here, I just have another cup, and it has gummies in it. So this is kind of our little snack thing that we keep right there. Usually there's more stuff, but yeah. And then, um, I don't want to bug Derek too much, but this is his little setup. He has this like Xbox controller thing, um, this FL Studio thing. I don't know what it is, but it lights up and it's really cool. Um, we have highlighters and pens and all that stuff. There's a random tarot deck here right now. It's kind of cool. Um, this is the mouse for our TV up here. And also this is the keyboard for the TV up here. So I usually do most of the typing because it's on my side. Um, Derek is working on art stuff right now. He does um, AI art stuff where he puts in like prompts and it generates it for him. So. Uh, follow his Instagram. I'll put that up on the screen. It's really really cool and he has a website and all that stuff too So I'll put that in and Yeah, he's just working on some stuff right now super cool he, This is what he does all day long and he can make art while he's gaming with me So we'll like get on Heroes of the Storm and stuff and he'll have it just like going while he's gaming. So it's super cool 
Uh, he has his keyboard and mouse and everything, and again, the same chair that I have, but his is black and mine is purple. And then over here, he has basically all of his cool artwork stuff. So again, this is more of his art that he's done over the years. He's been doing digital art since like 2014 or something like that. Um, this is his little mood board that he made. Um, little black temple poster. And then he has um, his laptop and some speakers and all of his modular synthesizer stuff. So yeah, lots of cool stuff over here. And then we have this really nice big tapestry that is all like sci-fi and really cool and some more wow posters down below. And that is it. That is all the way around the room. So, oh, and yes, also these are his cords for his modular synthesizer. And there's a printer down there and some shoes. So yeah, but that's the whole room. So I always like to give a quick little, you know, view of everything. So you can get a good idea of what the room environment is like. It looks so cool. We both feel so blessed with everything that we have. We love our little room. We've both been collecting things for so long. So yeah, this is the result when you put two gamers together and you get married and all that stuff. It's very, very cool. So I hope that you guys look, my husband's even wearing a horrid hoodie. Like how cool is that? He is the bomb. All right, so that was the whole room. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Um, I tried to go pretty in depth because I really wanted to show off the collection and everything. I've always wanted to do a video like this and everything. Let me know what you think down below in the comments. And if you have any questions or anything, let me know as well. And yeah, I'm basically just gonna get on to Classic WoW again. I'm planning to finish up questing in Zangermersh. Like I said, I'm like halfway through. And then I'm gonna head on to Terragar Forest. And I'm so excited to go to Nagrand again. It's been so many years since I've actually like you know, like played the Burning Crusade. Like I know that they have chromie time and retail and all that stuff, but to actually just like feel it again, like how it was back in the day and the Burning Crusade was my favorite. It's so fun. And even though it's dead right now on my server, I'm just enjoying like vibing and hanging out by myself. So, um, so yeah, that's pretty much what I'm gonna be up to recently. Um, and then in terms of retail, I mostly just do like mount achievements and like transmog runs and just mount collecting in general. I'm not a huge fan of all the Shadowlands stuff and Xeric Mortis is kind of weird. Um, I know that you can unlock flying now, but I haven't done that yet. So yeah, pretty much all I do these days is Classic WoW and Heroes of the Storm and mount collecting. So again, I hope that you guys enjoy my room and kind of get a feel into my everyday life because I literally, like this is me all day long. Like, this is all that I do, so. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!